Right, Peter, welcome to Newton Aircliff Football Club. Thank you. Uh, first question, why Aircliff? Yeah, uh, I've got a Alan Oliver, he rang me a couple of weeks ago actually. And uh, we'll be having discussions over the last two weeks about coming and uh, he's done a good job of selling the club to me really in terms of the potential. And uh, so it was crying out for some you know, decent results and hopefully we get some decent results. He's hopeful that the crowds will come back, you know. And, uh, he spoke about the type of crowds they had when they were successful in the second division. And he's talked about the type of crowds and the numbers that they used to get when they were in the uh, first division, the first season in the first division. And then it kind of, it's kind of faded away, but that's coincided with the poor results, you know, and get to where we are today. You know. Well, you know, before Saturday's game anyway, the fourth bottom, which speaks volumes really. So he's asked me to come in and try and improve fortunes on the pitch and, uh, and he's confident that if, if we do improve fortunes on the pitch then that will have a knock-on effect off the pitch and it will be like a catch-22 situation really whereby and hopefully it attract more interest and then attract more interest you know the fortunes on the pitch will improve also. I was talking to Alan the other day and uh, he reminded me that um, he seemed to have followed him around his, his career, he seemed to be taking his Taking his job, you took his job at Crook, you took his job at West Salt, and now you're taking his job at Aitliff. Yeah, I went into Crook and, and tidied up his his work, and and uh, you know, well, you know, Crook had been promoted since, but I was confident that we would have got promoted that year. The last year I was there, and then uh, we went to West Auckland and tidied up after him at West Auckland, and uh, and he's asked us to come in and sweep up after him again at, at Aitliff. So, you know, Alan's a football person, and. Uh, He's been the biggest attraction to come to Aircliff, I'm honest. He sold, he sold the, the whole setup. The setup's, you know, second to none at our level. And uh, you know, everything's in place apart from the team on the pitch, you know. And so hopefully we can do that.